Hey guys, and how's it going? So a couple of you had some questions about my music that I post. And so I just wanted to give you guys a quick tour of my studio and, you know, give you an idea of how I make my music. So I'm not working with a lot here. I'll back up so you can see what, what I'm working with here. Uh, this is a, quite a small room. I just have a bed with a sheet of plywood on it. Uh, these two computers right here are dumpster rescues that I fixed. Everything in here I uh, either rescued out of a dumpster or it was given to me to fix or it was something I found at a thrift store. So I'm not working with a ton of stuff here. I'm not working with a lot of money, not a fancy setup by any stretch of the imagination. Uh, but I just love playing with the stuff and it's fun to get different combinations of things. So right now I'm adding a violin track to a piece that I'm working on. This does have a capability of being directly connected to the computer and I can just use pro tools, but what fun is that? So everything's just connected to this tape recorder. And so I just record each track separately onto cassette and then that gets down mixed in audacity. And then I broadcast it over my AM transmitter. This is a pretty cool little thing. Uh, these are called I am home transmitters and realtors would put these in houses that were for sale and they would have a sign up in front of the house and you drive by and tune to the radio station that was on the sign out front. And there's a five minute chip on here and it would give you uh, information about the house in a loop. And so I just have repurposed it for uh, rebroadcasting stuff. Sometimes just to listen to things on vintage radios that I have around the house, uh, just to kind of give an aesthetic. It's especially nice around the holidays because uh, you can play Christmas music on a vintage radio, such as this one. This is a thrift store find, an All American Five that I repaired. It's an RCA. It does have an out uh, a headphone out jack which I love because I then broadcast from the radio transmitter to this radio uh, connected to that tape deck again. Pretty much that tape deck is my main recording source. A 40-year-old tape deck is pretty much all I need. And then I just clean things up, mix in Audacity, and then just broadcast through over AM to this radio, record it back to that, and I get that lo-fi mono sound that I really enjoy. And again, I make this music mostly for myself, but if you guys enjoy it, that's cool too. But anyway, until the next time, guys.